Well, we're gonna grab some hot boiling water, right? Woohoo! And we're gonna grab this right here. Easy enough, per package instructions. We're gonna grab some rigatoni pasta, 16 ounces. And then again, we're just gonna cook that up per package. All right, while we're allowing that pasta to boil, we're gonna have one and a fourth cups of heavy cream and get that into another pot. All right, now I'm using some evaporated milk. Just about, and a little more, a little more, right about five ounces. All right, then we're gonna go with this right here, some cheddar cheese soup. Yeah, right, get that opened up. Right, 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 there we go. And we're gonna take that cheddar cheese soup, right, Get that all out of the container. All right, now we're gonna go with some minced garlic, right? Mm -hmm. We are, and then we're going to go with just a little bit, you know, teaspoon, maybe two teaspoons worth. All right, once we got it in there, we're just gonna go ahead and take it, right? And we're gonna go ahead and stir all of that in and get it mixed good. All right, once I got it all stirred up, we're gonna go over medium heat for about five, six minutes until it starts to thicken up. Okay, so once you can see that there, it's starting to thicken up. You see that? All right, we're just gonna stir it, give it a good stir. All right, set that spoon off there. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna add some pepper. All right, now that we got the pepper in there, you knew it was coming, but you just didn't know when. Well, technically we use the soup cheese, but regular cheese, mozzarella, right? We're gonna go with just a little bit, you know, mozzarella, get that up in there. Then we're gonna take some Parmesan cheese, just a little bit, whatever you want, that's the beauty. There it is. So now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna stir it all in. It's hot enough where that cheese is already melting, starting to thicken up. And we're gonna start bringing it in like right here to the sauce, see this? Look at this, nice and thick, looking good, right? Ooh yeah, cheesy. And get all that in there. And now we're gonna go with some of this right here. Now if you've got some leftover fully cooked, right, chicken, Y'all can use that too. But I'm gonna go with this fully cooked rotisserie chicken, right? We're just gonna go ahead, cut, our, saw, uh, cut us up some chicken. All right, now we're just gonna drop in a few cups worth of chicken. Okay, so once you got it like this, and you got all of the chicken right in there, all mixed around, we're gonna go with some cream of chicken soup, right? One standard size uh, 10 and a half ounce can. We're gonna get that mixed in. And go with a nine by 13. You knew that was coming as well, but you just, again, didn't know when. Now we're gonna take, and we're gonna spoon it all on the nine by 13 and lay it and spread it out. And I'm taking some Parmesan, eh, as much as you want, and we're gonna get that layered on top once it's all smoothed out. But you think it was done? Not yet. More cheese, please. We're gonna go with a little bit of mozzarella on top. This is a little bit more extra pepper on top. Okay, we're gonna go 350 degrees, big Fahrenheit. Now, everything's fully cooked. Remember, that's a fully cooked chicken. Pasta's fully cooked. We need to melt the cheese and heat up the cream of chicken in that, and then we'll be ready, so it won't take long at all. Would you look at that right there. Cheesy chicken rigatoni? Hmm. Wow, look at that. For an easy, fast meal, look at that, we'll just plate it up, right? You could probably put some like green onions or maybe any kind of green garnish on top, right? Any kind of herb, I'm thinking, fresh. Okay, I couldn't help myself. I had some fresh Italian parsley, so I chopped it up. And look at that right there, again. Okay. I'm all about the fast, the speed, and trying things for a first time, sharing my experience and that with you guys. I appreciate you. Bon appetit. <laughs> mm. oh. What's not... Just get out there and make this.